place in the lead up to this game, but as you can see, the last couple of hours are a rather different story. The weather has decided not to play ball. The conditions here are a long way from ideal. It is teeming with rain, and that has left both teams contemplating very different challenges. It's almost old style. Understandable looks of concern on the faces of managers, officials, players and fans alike. This is, of course, the Camp Nou, one of the best known, perhaps the best known of all the venues in European football. And already we're underway here. Big chop, he's gone for it! There it is! There is the breakthrough! And that really is so, so impressive. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction, I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's through, now is he in? That's great defensive work, it doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. It's admirable, but ultimately he didn't know when to look for support. There will be a throw-in. Just to point out, Peter, that the full-backs are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Hoists it forward. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Goes direct to the front line. He's managed to get himself offside. Keeper sends it forward. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Up to meet it! Fair attempt, just the wrong outcome. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then.
steered forward. Danger averted for now. And it's played forward. Just the goalkeeper to beat. Has a hit! And the half-time whistle goes. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. And if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. Here we go again. Well, I'm sure the managers talk the talk, and now it's time for these players to walk the walk and deliver a rousing response to a rousing team talk. Forward it goes. Gets good distance on it. And it's been taken straight back. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking... Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Pinged forward. Has he found his man? It's being played forward. It could be... Has a pop! Back of the net! And there's the goal they've been looking for. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. So that's two now without reply. We're looking at a very different game now. The command has been established. Looking to force his way through. And that's sprayed out wide. And out to safety. And it's played forward. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Cut out in the nick of time. Here it is. Oh, shooting chance.
great leap! And with that, the final whistle. No joy for the players, nor indeed for the loyal fans. It has ended in defeat, a thoroughly disappointing outcome. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Look, Peter, a strength in any team has to be at the heart of your defence. And I'm afraid they were found wanting in that department. Well, that's it for today. Thank you, Jim, and goodbye.